of the Bhagavad Gita, the quintessential philosophical gem of Vedic tradition. Here is Arjuna, one of the greatest warriors of the time, who comes to Krishna to seek help in the war against the Kauravas. Arjuna has gone through many years of training for this one moment, to prove himself in the biggest stage of his life as the greatest warrior who ever lived. He's even practiced and acquired different weaponry and mastered different instruments of war for this important moment that he must win. Krishna informs Arjuna that he will help him, but cannot physically engage and will not physically engage in the battle. He would guide Arjuna into war as the charioteer. Krishna drives the brave Arjuna to the battlefield of Kurukshetra. Arjuna steps down from the chariot, looks at the other army on the other side of the field and sees extended family members, his grandfather, cousins, and many other loved ones. He breaks down, unable to bear the sight. He would rather lose his kingdom than have to fight a war with his own family. He becomes disillusioned and falls into a deep depression, not knowing how to proceed or cease forward. He is confused and in need of Krishna's counsel. Krishna tells Arjuna to let go of any attachments, seeing how the opposing force and the army are an evil one. Krishna tells Arjuna the importance of seeing the virtue of the being instead of the emotional or materialistic characters associated with the person. Krishna addresses Arjuna his duty and gives the warrior a lesson on ethics and morality. He assures Arjuna, even though the physical body might perish, the soul is everlasting. The battlefield of Kurukshetra is a metaphor for the complex challenges faced by humanity. The Bhagavad Gita is the main philosophical guideline for navigating through the complex challenges one faces in life. Intelligent decisions are made by assessing virtue instead of falling for and being overwhelmed by emotional attachments. Krishna takes a further step to ensure Arjuna's confidence and through his Vishwarupa shows Arjuna the majesty of his form and how he truly encompasses the whole universe. A multi-form, wondrous vision with countless mouths and eyes and celestial ornaments brandishing many divine weapons. Everywhere was boundless divinity, containing all astonishing things, wearing divine garlands and garments, anointed with divine perfume. If the light of a thousand suns were to rise in the sky at once, it would be like the light of that great spirit. Gita Vedasha.
Thank you. 